What is up everybody, my name is Commander, and welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. It has been a while since I've actually done a video, especially one on the center map. Um, I've been doing a lot of streaming recently, and uh, so today I wanted to get out of video. My servers are currently down, so there's no re way for me to play, so I figured I might want to actually do some how-to videos and stuff. So today, the first video we're going to work on today is how to, how to, build the poor man's wall. And you might be like, what's the poor man's wall? Well, I'm going to show you. All right, guys. So we have got the poor man's wall set up right now. And what you will see is, first off, I'm going to make sure my headset is plugged in. Yes, it is plugged in. So we don't have to worry about losing audio and me having to re-record this. So what you are seeing right here is the poor man's wall. Uh, this is legitimately one wall here. And then one, two, three walls this way. And how does this work? Why does this work? Well, we're going to go ahead and we're going to go cheat God. We are now God. And there was a Karna over here. All right, guys. So we first have our Karna here. And the Karna can step over a two high wall. And as you can see, we have spaces where it is a one high wall. And then we have spaces where it is three high. Now, the question is, can we get this Karna over? Absolutely. So, does the poor man's wall work here? No. No, it doesn't. So, what you're going to want to do... And hold on, let's, let's try one other thing real quick. We have another wall here. However, we cannot get over this wall. So, a foundation wall with that wall seems like it might be a better choice. Uh, that is built out of foundation fence, fence foundations. Well, this is built out of actual foundations. And the reason for that is... Your foundations are much more expensive, and if you're poor man, you can't flood these spots, and you might not have the resources for the foundation. But if you do have bigger plans, and maybe you just don't have the stone on hand at this moment, well, this is an option. So what we can do for the poor man's wall to make it work against Karnos is place another one. Now suddenly we can't get through. But this is not the only thing the poor man's wall can stop. Let's look at something a little bigger. Alright guys, so we now have a Rex, and actually a really cool looking one. I've never seen these colors, but that's what random color dinos get you. And the poor man's wall actually will stop, as you'll see, it'll stop this Rex. You can see the Rex can't get through even over this two high wall. In fact, it can't even get over this one high wall. Why? Because the poor man's wall is designed to abuse the fact that the Rex requires two sp spaces to get through. Had this wall been... Had the wall been like this... The rats apparently can't climb over it still. Hmm. Well, that's really interesting, but you know... I have seen Rexes before clear too high structures. I mean, as you can see there, he did get through that. I have seen Rex clear two high structures and actually go into three. Uh, it just really depends. So guys, we have got another beautiful dino here. This Giga looks pretty cool. And what I can tell you is the Giga can clear three high structures. As you can see, what? Yep, there we go. So the Giga on a poor man's wall can just about clear as you can see he cleared a three high structure so if you're wanting to prevent a Giga from getting over so we're gonna hop back on the Giga and now you'll see the poor man's wall even stops the Giga now will the Giga be friendly and not just chomp down on the wall well that's a question to be held on a different uh, uh, a different scenario here uh, the poor man's wall is not really meant to stop a Giga, but it will stop the Giga from getting through, even from the upper angle. It comes through on a... It, it, it's going to prevent the Giga from walking into your base passively and attacking your stuff. Now, aggressively, well, it might just eat the gate. So, if you are building a poor man's wall and you're trying to stop Gigas, maybe you should build it out of metal so that doesn't happen. But guys, 
that is going to be it for the poor man's wall. I hope you learned something, as always. Uh, but that's going to be it for this video, guys. You all take care. And I'll catch you next time.